The main reasons for switching on an ATV's A-arms are to change its width, to allow for the use of different length shocks, and to add camber and caster adjustability. Camber measures how much the top of your front wheels tilt in. Ideally, you want to run just enough camber to keep your outside tire's contact patch parallel with the ground under hard cornering. Caster measures how far back or how far forward your upper A-arm is in relationship to the lower one. Caster affects how fast the machine turns in or how stable it is at high speed. Adding caster or moving the upper A-arms back makes an ATV track better at high speed, while less caster or having the upper A-arms more directly above the lower A-arms makes an ATV turn in faster, but reduces high speed stability. Today you can purchase machines in either the 46 or 50 inch width range to best suit your riding style. Most high-end models feature fully adjustable shocks, but adjustable A-arms are still an uncommon feature. Spending $2,500 on new A-arms and shocks just to be able to dial in your front end's geometry is simply unaffordable for most riders. To solve this dilemma, Texeratech offers their trick fully adjustable upper A-arms for as little as $295. Texeratech builds their upper A-arms for most popular high-performance ATV models, including the KTMs and Honda 700XX. Texera's upper A-arms provide the benefit of camber and caster adjustment and feature one of the easiest to use caster adjustment systems on the market. Simply loosen the pinch bolts and slide the upper A-arms forward or rearward. The A-arms allow you to adjust roughly between 3 and 8 degrees of caster. Interlocking teeth on the upper arms and the castle washers allow you to perfectly align caster on both sides without the need to measure and remeasure. Each position moves the upper A-arm around 1.2 degrees. Texeratech constructs their A-arms out of TIG welded 4130 chromoly. They feature sealed, high-quality, heavy-duty frat ball joints and sealed Delrin pivot bushings with breezable, hardened ground pivot sleeves. You can upgrade the Delrin bushings with needle bearings for an additional $60. Texeratech tells us that the needle bearings triple the life of the Delrin bushings and pivot sleeves. This reduces maintenance and saves money over time due to reduced replacement part costs. They come standard with a durable wrinkle black powder coat finish, with other colors and chroming available for a bit more. A while back, we had the opportunity to try a set of Texeratex upper A-arms on a Kawasaki KFX450R built by CT Racing. The test took place in the California desert, in an area with lots of high speeds, deep whoop sections, and a private motocross track thrown in. The Kawasaki has a lot going for it, however in stock trim, the front end has very little caster. It's quick steering and can be a handful in braking bumps and at extremely high speeds. We set Texera's arms up with 6.6 .6 degrees of caster, slotting them back to their second to the last position. With these changes, the front end wanders less at high speed. The mild reduction in steering sensitivity keeps small inputs to the bars from overly affecting the machine's direction, like the stock caster settings do. Fortunately, there seems to be no trade-off. The KFX frame geometry is aggressive by nature, so the steering remains responsive. If you're planning on adding only a handful of modifications to your KFX, Texeratex upper A-arms should definitely be one of them. More caster makes the KFX 450 more manageable. Less caster reduces the 700 double legs tendency to push. Machines like the Suzuki LTR 450 become even more effective when you can set the front end up for tighter or faster tracks or trails. The YFZ 450R's caster mildly increases as its suspension goes through its travel, something that's more noticeable when running softer aftermarket suspension. Texera's upper A-arms for the YFC 450R come with an additional set of brackets to maintain the front end's caster as the front shocks go through their travel. If you aren't looking to change the width of your ATV, or you don't want or need to make the investment in a full set of aftermarket A-arms and shocks, the benefit to price ratio makes Texera Tech's adjustable upper A-arms one of the biggest improvements you can make to your ATV for the money. For more information on Texeratech's adjustable upper A-arms and their full line of ATV chassis components, log on to texeratech.com.